This series of videos is going to walk you through the process of creating a basic website in Adobe Dreamweaver 2017. 2018 is the version that's installed on the classroom computers currently, and an even later version is also available. So chances are you're going to be working in a later version of Dreamweaver than the one that's shown on the video. It shouldn't affect your workflow. Uh, there's really not much difference between 2017 and the newer versions. When you go to create a web page and set up a site, that actually may not match what's in the video. So I'm going to give you kind of a shortcut or another way to do it because it's really important that you get the site set up correctly. Otherwise, nothing else is going to work. So what I would recommend to set up the site is to download these exercise files, uh, just the exercise files folder and then go ahead and create a new folder inside of the exercise files next to the assets folder. So the assets folder is something that you need. Uh, images and, and content are stored in here. And name this new folder website. And then go into Dreamweaver. And go to File new, uh, select HTML, hit create, and then click on site, new site. Under site name, type in the word website so that it matches the name of your folder that you just created. And then under local site folder, choose this little folder icon, click on that, find the folder that you set up. So you need to find um, where exercise files is stored. Double click on that, select your website folder and then select choose and then select save. And when you do that, you should see it says site and then website, which is the name of your folder. And it should show you the file path. So once you have your site set up, named website, then you can go ahead and, and then continue on with chapter two and everything should work for you. When you've completed the tutorial, you're going to turn in your website folder. So inside your website folder, you should have a CSS folder with a styles.css document inside. You should have an images folder with a couple of images inside, and then you should have your index.html document. So my recommendation is to create an assignment folder. So it's your last name underscore BCD 1015 and then underscore the uh, assignment number. Drag your website folder into it, but hold option so that you're making a copy and then drag that into your assignment folder. So this is what you're going to be turning into me. Keep a copy of your folder inside the exercise files folder or the original place that you've stored it because you're going to be continuing work on this web page and uh, this is the home folder and you don't want to move your files outside of it. So again, um, your exercise files folder inside there, you're going to have your website folder with your document and its assets and then you're going to make a copy inside of an assignment folder, which is what you're going to turn into me. And so, of course, you're going to go ahead and zip that folder. And you're going to upload the zip file to the assignment link.